Yeah, we're here at the Villages VA Hospital today to see if they respect our right to film in public and check up on our public officials. I'm also going to be looking at the uh, uh, COVID testing drive through center. One of our transport vehicles here. For us veterans, get back and forth where we need to go to. And more of our vehicles here. Help us get around to the points we need to get to. Oh. And today we see the flag flying half staff, presumably for uh, Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg at the Villages VA outpatient clinic. So, uh, here in the Villages, and our beautiful flag. The health screening to get into the VA center. It's insidious virus. Hopefully there'll be a vaccine to it here pretty soon. Yeah, they've got the clinics open now. They were closed for a while, except for appointments and emergencies only. But they're open partially, you know, for people with, with need, whatever need entails. screening area mass required in the uh, VA facility hopefully this uh, virus terrible virus will be over soon and we'll be able to get back to some similar to a normalcy It's a lovely facility here. It's uh, not very old, less than 10 years old, I'd say. I think it was uh, in the teens, whenever they uh, put this facility in. Beautiful construction. It was a creative. Whoever designed it, built it, put a lot of creativity in it. And it's self-contained. They have all of the uh, amenities a person would need: X-rays, uh, you know, colonoscopy, gastro specialists. Vision center, hearing, dentistry. So, uh, kind of modern, up to date clinic. And 
over the past uh, 20 years, we, as veterans, we've seen a large increase, a major increase in the health care at these facilities. I remember when I first started going to the VA, how the health care was so terrible. It's still not the greatest in the world, but it is a, remarkably a lot better than it used to be. Yeah, you actually get friendly staff here. Uh, the uh, doctors are a little overworked, a lot overworked, but they do the best they can. And for government health care, this is really some of the better health care that you're going to get. You know, if you're going to use a standard, a government standard to give health care out to the people, you can't beat the VA system. You know, it's not going to be top tier medical because it is government, but it gets the job done. And around the side here, they have a... Uh, portico where early in the mornings before the facility opens around 7 starting around 7 a.m. they try to get a lot of the COVID patients or those who want to get tested uh, to drive around the building and uh, get tested here at this center or this portico it keeps them away the patients isolated for the most part away from the clinic itself and uh, people come out you know do the uh, testing which is probably the most effective testing so far is the old stick up the nose and as Trump said, make a right at the eyeball. <laughs> but this is the ambulance center, ambulance area. And uh, we, I can't make it out here early enough to, uh, no weapons or firearms allowed. Let's see what they have here for visitation policies. I'll let y'all pause it here and read whatever they have. This entrance is closed. Ambulance entrance. I'm not going to go up in there because of the virus. <laughs> well, I have no need to go in today for uh, public records requests. I do have a few public records requests I would like to make but on this first day I'm just going around to judge a reaction from the uh, clinic itself. So far they seem to understand that a person with a camera poses no threat and it left me alone knock on wood. So I'm not going to press it today, but I will come in and make my public records request at some point in the very near future.
Village's VA outpatient clinic and our beautiful flag flying half staff today in the remembrance of Chief Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg and the measures they have to go through today to ensure safety with the patients being taken and the uh, security people here not paying any mind to me leave me alone let me do my job so the village's VA is surprisingly a pass I'm gonna go ahead and end it here and keep my body cam live as I go out to the road and Yes, yeah, so I like this. No, I'm doing public records request if I could with you. I'd like to find out how many COVID patients were treated here yesterday. <laughs> so, uh, could you give me some background for you? Yes, I'd just like to do a, a public records request to find out how many public, how many COVID okay. patients were treated here yesterday. How many, how many were uh, went through and were screened? There's a methodology to go about that. We can, we can oh, it's public. It's that. public record. I'm not asking for names. I'm just asking yeah. for a how much number, a number. So I see that you have a breast thing on, and I'm not sure what, that, what that's all. What's, mm -hmm. what's going on? Yeah, it's is yeah. what it is. Okay, well, can you identify yourself and tell us what, who you're with? And um, you just call me a good citizen. Okay. <laughs> Hi, how's it going, sir? Do I have to do anything out here? Or can I go in? Uh, yes, sir. You can actually uh, head up to the uh, to the front. Did you? Yeah. Did you? Did you, did you uh, Yes, sir. Did you, did you, uh, do you have an appointment here? No, I'm just trying to find what's the Okay, they should be able to help you up there. Don't, don't uh, so, sir, there's a way to go about that. We can mm -hmm. work with you. If you give us, uh, give us some information, we can work with you on that. Okay, okay, sounds good. Yeah, I'll, just, I'll give you my email address and have you all email me the uh, so number. A way, there's a uh, methodology to do it. Yeah, there's, there's statutes, it, statutes yeah. applied to uh, open yeah. records requests, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. so are you with some specific agency or is this? I'm with America. Okay, okay. So. Sounds good. Mm -hmm. Hi, how's it going? Good, Doc, how we doing? All right, he's just, uh, he's coming here and he's uh, wanting to uh, get, get a uh, records request. And I said, well, I was just in here today to go around the building on the outside and I was on my way out actually whenever you called me over. Okay. But since you asked, you know, I was going to come back in here at a later date, probably uh, very soon and do a public records request. Okay. But um, I figured today I would just kind of dose you a little bit to, to the press, to the media. You know, okay. come out here, do a little filming, and leave, and maybe come back, and, get, and you, maybe y'all can get a little bit of education as to public photography and the press, First Amendment, that type of thing. Okay. Yeah, with the press, you just have to get permission from Gainesville to do it. No, no, with the no, no, no. With the no, press, you do. No, with, no. As far no. as personal? We have a First people, Amendment right here, I officer. I understand that, sir. Yeah. We understand that, mm -hmm. okay? But when it comes to the press, yeah. okay, if you work for a, a newspaper or a press... No, no, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a citizen journalist. A citizen okay. journalist? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Well, a First Amendment auditor, press. Okay. So we come in, we so educate. You work for a press company. No, no, I, do, I work for myself. You work for yourself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, so, like I said, in, in the future, press the press personnel, mm -hmm. regardless of what it is, a press has to get permission. From Negative. Me. Okay. I'm just letting you know. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, but if you're just taking pictures of the outside mm -hmm. and not personal information and, and all that. We can't stop you from doing that, but if you were if you're writing an article and what a press and take a picture, press have to get permission from Gainesville. Press is written in the First Amendment. That's our first law. Yeah, freedom well, of the press. So, it. That's, so it's press. To. It's press. Okay. You're talking about commercial media. Correct. Yeah. Okay, I'm talking about press. Okay. So that's what we're going on here. Okay. We're going on a word, but the word is press. Okay. So I'm not com not commercial. Not I'm not commercial media. I'm press. Okay. Okay. Right. So, is so there, if you come back and have a request, we'll, I'll, I'll we'll come back for my public records request. Okay. I'll just yeah. uh, go on the side and get my public records request that way. Okay, sounds good. Okay, okay. today it was just more or less introduction to, you know, I was hoping somebody would come out and I would just, you know, go through this. You know, I'm here, no threat. I'm just here yeah. for, with the press. Okay. okay. You know, people tend to mix media, press. It's all really used inter interchangeably, you know. But I don't work for a, a large commercial agency. I just do for myself. So. so, okay.
So you're just taking it, you're doing it for yourself is what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I actually so, dis disseminating the information out to the public. So, yeah. As, as, and so uh, part of the issue for us is because we're a government agency, mm -hmm. and as he was saying, if we speak to someone and it's for, for media and that sort of thing, it's really for us and how we're supposed mm -hmm. to present, and that's what Gainesville does for us is, is helps us work with, with that. Okay, discussion. okay, yeah. Yep. Yeah, today today was more or less just come out, uh, let people who can't get out and about see the, the VA, you know, let people see the screening process because you had to be screened on the way in. I know they op just recently opened up the uh, uh, facilities to mm -hmm. the public, so. Yeah, a lot of companies, yes, a lot of places are still yeah. doing the screening and everything. Are you yeah. a veteran as well? I'm not going to answer any questions. Oh. Oh, okay. it's just a simple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. That's yeah. part of that's part of the part of the process is you know we don't give out too much information you okay. know, and uh, leave people wanting, <laughs> you know, right. government well, gover like government government wanting rather. Yeah. Is the thing, and that's yeah. why I was asking the question. Yeah. So. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Have a great day. okay. Thank you very much, Doc. I will give you my name. Since you since you were so cordial and everything, okay. I'll give I'll give give him my name. Okay, that's fine. Give to him. Well, okay. I don't have anything. Write it down. I just want to write it down. Yeah. Yeah. Write it down. That's all. Okay. Elbow bump. Yeah, sure. Doctor Sean Berry. Okay. Your, la your name's Sean. Doctor Sean Berry. Okay. Is it S E A or S H A W N? S H A W N. Yeah. Berry. B E R R Y. B E R R Y. Excellent. Okay. Thank you. Okay. 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 All right. Sean, All right. Okay. Y'all have a great day. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Doc. There you have it. A little bit of education goes a long way. Next time I'll come back in and do my public records request. They seem to think there's some sort of a special process of getting just numbers, statistics. But it's all public record, public information.